Julian Assange, journalist and co-founder of WikiLeaks, has been in prison for the last three years. Assange, who was arrested on April 11, 2019, from the Ecuadorian embassy in London, is being kept at the high-security Belmarsh prison in the United Kingdom. Commemorating the day of this grave injustice to human rights and press freedom, Projections have been put up around London to demand his release. People from progressive sections across the world, including Dilma Rousseff, Yanis Varoufakis, Roger Waters, Rafael Correa and others have sent a letter to US President Joe Biden demanding that the charges against him be dropped. The Supreme Court of the United Kingdom on March 14th had rejected an appeal against extradition filed by Julian Assange. The appeal was filed after the High Court in London overturned a lower court's ruling denying the extradition request by the United States in February. The decision will now be formally sent to the UK Home Office currently headed by Home Secretary Preeti Patel of the Conservative Party government. Assange's lawyers will then have four weeks to present grounds for objection. Assange's lawyers then plan to revisit some of the other grounds against extradition previously raised in the courts but which failed to be considered. These may include the political nature of the ongoing indictment in the US, conditions of US prisons, and even his rights as a publisher that protect him from such legal prosecutions against him. Despite the fact that Assange faces no criminal prosecution in the country, the British courts continue to incarcerate him at the behest of the US at the maximum security prison in Belmarsh. The Joe Biden administration continues to pursue the Trump-era policy of prosecuting Assange and WikiLeaks for exposing U.S. war crimes in Iraq and Afghanistan. In January 2021, Judge Vanessa Baritza ruled that Assange could not be extradited to the U.S. This was due to concerns regarding the negative effect that U.S. prison conditions would have on his mental health and the high risk of him committing suicide. However, in December 2021, the High Court overturned her verdict. Assange is being indicted in the U.S. under the infamous Espionage Act and the Computer Fraud and Abuse Act. He faces a total of 18 federal criminal charges, including espionage and cyber crimes, which together carry a maximum sentence of 175 years.